Hello once again YouTube and welcome to another video with The Domain and today I just want to start by thanking you all from the bottom of my heart for 20,000 subscribers. That's a milestone that we've been aiming towards for many years. We just jumped from 17 to 20 in no time at all, so thank you all so much. I can't wait to see what the future holds. But I've also noticed that my most popular video recently is my Halo Heroes unboxing. So I thought, I'll give you guys what you want. We've got some more Halo Heroes today, plus some more armories and Spartan packs. It's going to be a great haul. Let's check it out. So this video is brought to you by World Trader for Mega Constructs. They have been scoring me so many epic Halo items at the minute. You should check them out, and they're giving away a UNSC Infinity throughout the month of June. So really, head over to that Facebook page. It's an amazing place. Today, we've got four Halo Heroes. I know you guys like the random aspect of this, so we're going to draw them blindly. The first one is... Whoa! Captain Lasky of the UNSC Infinity. I also noticed that these are already opened. I'm not a man of steel, all right? I, I had to check them out. I couldn't wait till I unboxed them on camera. So we're gonna just unbox them again, why not? It doubles the fun for me. <laughs> so this Lasky is the first Series 7 I've got my hands on. I'm also after the Carter Dutch and Jordan Dame. It was a very good series. And he looks pretty badass. You may have already seen this Lasky in my UNSC Infinity unboxing. I compared it to the gray Lasky that you get with the Infinity. I don't know which one I prefer. I go back and forth. This, uh, this desert color is really cool. And there are so many highlights, so many paint applications. Pop that in there. These are all from quite old series, so I'm not going to be complaining about the Series 11 and Series 10 display bases, but these displays are so much nicer. He's got some beautiful applications on his shoulders especially. He's got a really nice painted magnum. That's our first Halo Heroes of the day, Captain Lasky. And this is one of the only ones that the pinned eyes don't look that jarring. It looks pretty good. I give this a solid 10 out of 10. Frey, we're going to have to give you an IOU on that welcome home party. Tom Lasky, first officer of the Infinity. Never thought I'd see you again. Halo Heroes number two, we've got series nine. Whoa. It's ODST Graves. Pop him on out. Series 9 of Halo Heroes was a really strong one. Cesse Refumi, Captain Keys and Spartan George. Still looking for that George and Keys. Hit me up, Halos. Fans, Halo guys, hit me up. I need some more. ODST Graves. I'm really looking forward to getting the ODST Lang side by side with this one. And the yellow base plate, also really nice. I feel like each of these videos has a different season. Where's his weapon? Did I... Did I throw it out? Okay, one existential collector's crisis later, I found the gun. I really thought I'd lost it and it's the only one I have. But there we go. Graves ODST from the new Halo Arcade. Pretty awesome. I mean, the, the paint is spot on. I um, just love these assault rifles. They're so great. And he's got a nice UNSC logo on his chest. He's even got his name just so finely printed. And he also has these little elastic leg straps. That's a really nice ODST. You guys know I just love ODSTs. I'm hugely biased. The ring is called Halo. As far as we know, it's a powerful and ancient weapon. Captain Keys is placing the Pillar of Autumn in Combat Alert Alpha. It's payback time, ODST. Move out. We got two more Halo heroes, and these guys kind of... <laughs> there they are. These guys kind of come as a set. This one's from Series 6. It's Spartan Grant from the UNSC Infinity. I guess he goes perfectly with Lasky, and he is part of Fireteam Majestic. Pop it open. Halo Hero Series 6, also really cool. I have Shipmaster Let Volia. That is nice. I am very impressed with this figure. The paint application seems spot on, especially on his back. He's got a nice silver DMR, always nice. I don't know if I have any colored DMRs, so that's cool. The new articulation just really shines when it comes to DMRs and battle rifles, because you can just hold them 
so nicely. The white applications go all over his body. Even the detail of the helmet print on its own, just the blue is, is really high quality. And he's also got this yellow Fireteam Majestic logo on only one of his arms, but really cool. Pop the display on, we got a purple one this time. Halo Hero is just such a great collectibles item. After this, I think I've got at least one of every series other than Series 5, but nobody really has those, unless they want to pay hundreds of dollars. There we are. Very nice. It would be cool one day to get a full Fire Team Majestic, but I'm one more step of the way there. And hey, why don't I go one step further? We've got one more Fire Team Majestic today. Can you guess which one it is? Wow. It's Spartan Madison. Very nice. I love all and everything recon. Everything and all, all and everything. I love recon. It seems like the sniper's painted to a really nice degree. It's got two different colors on top of the base gray. I love this paint application on his uh, back chest piece. Really nice. He's got the Majestic logo as well. Cool orange visor. I'm really impressed with these Fireteam Majestics. Let's pop this display base together. He is a bulky figure. Again, sniper rifles also just so nice to position with the new articulation. Look at that. We got two of these. Fireteam Majestic. Let's go. I think now the only Fireteam Majestic figure I'm missing is Hoya. Planet supposed to have been cleared already. That was the idea. Yeah. These things just pop up wherever they want to, don't they? I mean, how is that even fair, huh? Closing these doors because that is way too windy. Oh, okay. We've got an armory pack and a battle pack to go. And I'm very excited about both of these. First of all, we've got the Brute Weapons Customizer Pack. That is so badass, especially getting some more banished figures. <laughs> Just flip it down. Uh, especially getting some more banished figures. I'm very excited about this one. Sunshine. First off, we got these two storage crates, and I think, yeah, I think you can customize them. Please let me know which of these sets you would like to see full reviews of. I'm more than happy to, but I think I will already recommend these very highly. They look so cool. That's number one. And number two. They kind of follow that sort of jagged, banished look. I like them a lot. And then we've got the two brutes. Pop them out. So they seem to follow slightly different color variations, which is cool. They haven't gone for just highlights setting them apart. They are slightly different colors, and they also have matching silver and dark gray crates. And then we've got an assortment of weapons. We'll go for the painted ones first. Oh, it's got beautiful accentuated markings with this silver. Standard trip mine, plasma rifle. I just love painted plasma rifles. They always do so well with the painted tip like it is firing some plasma, a spiker that's a silver and a black design, and then no painted detailing with these three weapons, but I don't mind at all. Wait, did I call that a spiker? Maybe. We'll give the silver brute the silver gravity hammer, of course. We'll give you the plasma rifle. Just really nice. When I first saw the design for the banished brutes, I thought they were just too far away from actual brutes. They didn't look right, but in my hand, I've been proven time and time again that they do actually work really nicely. For a weapons pack alone, this has a lot to offer. Two brand new banished brutes, three painted weapons, three basic, two weapon crates. It's a done deal for me. And we've got one more today, the Spartan 4 Team Battle Pack. Very nice indeed. It comes with two elite rangers, a Spartan Vector and a Spartan Athlon. And this was an awesome one to score from World Trader for Mega Constructs. Let's rip it open. Let's tear into this beast. Whoa. So for the price point, I think it does come with quite a lot. It only comes with four weapons, I think, which compared to a weapons pack isn't very much. But you do get four figures and 
some accessories here. I'm especially excited about all these display rods as well. Nice little butt club. Whoa, hey, it does come with muzzle flares. That's cool. Barricade, ammo crate. These display bases are nice. We've got the standard ones, but then we've also got these new ones. A really cool Elite Ranger. Wow, the molding on those feet as well. Stands so tall. Very nice silver accents around here. Yep, the helmet pops off. It would be cool if these packs sometimes come with additional helmets that you could swap out. Arch his feet backwards and he can be flying through the battlefield. Honestly, for the price point, you got four figures and all these accessories. I don't mind that the weapons aren't painted. Two elite rangers there flying around. I got a few Athlons already, but no Spartan Vectors. That is a really nice figure. Very bulky shoulders. We'll give him the Hydra. I've never seen this mold before. Oh, cool. It comes with a, a stock as well. This is straight out of like Halo 5 Guardians accessories. You can really just customize the weapons in that game. Slide the sight on right there. That's really cool. And then the thing I'm really excited about, we've got muzzle flares. Look at that. And that's the first one I've ever got from Mega Constructs and that's really cool. Wow really adds some life to your dioramas too and for the hydra there we go that's the full muzzle flare honestly i would i would put two of them on different figures so you can have two weapons firing and that immediately makes a really cool diorama well done mega blocks you've come a long way with your spartan weapon packs i want to give one more thanks to world trader for mega constructs for setting me up with these sets I've got even more from that page on the way. And yeah, you can win yourself an infinity, awesome runner-up prizes, or you can just head over to their Facebook page and buy some Halo because they're selling so much. Look at all that. If you ask me, that's a really good haul for the day. To recap today, we got Captain Lasky from the UNSC Infinity, Spartan Madsen and Spartan Grant from Fireteam Majestic, Graves from the new Halo Combat Evolve Arcade. Then we've got the two banished brutes with their weapons packs and really cool how they're slightly different shades then we've got Spartan 4 team battle with two elite rangers a vector and an athlon muzzle flare some accessories i am really happy with these sets today thank you very much for tuning in thank you so much for 20,000 subscribers i feel like i've worked a long time for that goal i kind of lost hope that i'd ever get there but recently the overwhelming support has accelerated our plans. And even after a couple of days, we're already like 120 subscribers more or something. We're getting stronger and stronger by the day. And I'll see you guys next time. Check out World Trader for Mega Constructs. And the Banished Brute is signing off. Ooh, lost some accessories there. <laughs>